Well, we had to order a plethora of items. First up is the flight, which we'll go over the flavors in a second. We got two of the cookies and one of their stuffed cinnamon rolls. Also, if you get two or more cobblers on the flight, you get a side of ice cream. Where are all my sweet tooth fans at? I guess the place that's sitting directly behind me is about to rock my socks. They established in 2013 in Tennessee. It was a food truck and then they were bought out and then they franchised. I guess there's a whole bunch of cool things going in here. They were known for their cobblers, but they do cinnamon rolls and cookies that are supposed to be better than crumble. You tell me something like that, I'm going to show up. Let's go find out. Today we're in Gahanna, Columbus, Ohio. And we're checking out the, the Peach Cobbler, Cobbler Factory. We just had dinner. I'm ready for dessert. And apparently this is the place to be. Come on, guys. All right, let's go see. Hi, welcome in. It smelled delicious in here. Yes, it does. Listen, we've heard a lot of great things. Right. We've never been to one before. Can you tell us a little bit about what we're getting ourselves into? Yeah, so you're in the right place. We are all about cobblers here. We have 12 different cobblers on the board. All of those come out warm with ice cream. We oh, also wow. have gooey gooey cinnamon rolls on the board. They are to die for. And we have a stuffed cinnamon roll that is my favorite thing on the menu. Oh man. Right here in our case, you can see all the cookies that we have on display here. We make them fresh and we bake fresh every single day. Those look insane. What, wait, what's in the flights? So yeah, the flights are fun. You get, if you've never tried anything with us before, you get to pick and choose any of the cobblers, any of the banana puddings to go in there. So there's 12 cobblers, 12 banana puddings, and you can mix and match in your flight. Look at all these options that they have up here, and some of those flavors sound outstanding. They even have brownies, waffles, churro sticks, refreshments as well, and I guess they bottle their own peach tea. For all you photogenic people, they have a photo op, and then they have additional seating down here. This is a pretty cool wall. Y'all, look at this stuff. It looks so good. And then you have some more seating over here with some TVs. So I had to try this tea. I guess they do this in-house every single day. A lot of this stuff she was telling me is made to order. It's not just sitting around. So this is a sweet peachy tea. Oh my God, that is delicious. That is really good actually. Y'all, I'm not a tea drinker, but this has made me a believer. This is fantastic. If you come here, get one of these. I promise you it's gonna change your life. These cookies are massive. First up, we're trying the peanut butter and jelly cookie. Cheers. Mmm, fantastic. I love peanut butter and it jelly. Tastes just like peanut butter and jelly. It does. Let me know down in the comment section. I think peanut butter and jelly goes together like grapes and carrots all day long. That is decadent. It is sweet. That peanut butter, there's just enough on there. It's not overbearing, but enough to get its point across. If you've ever had a grilled peanut butter and jelly sandwich, this is the cookie for you. I'm not a big sweet guy, but I am a red velvet fanboy of anything. And this cookie looks like it's going to be up my alley. Mm -hmm. That cookie is so big. Mm. The icing. The icing on this is fantastic. Listen, y'all, you all know I don't like crumble cookies. I would take these over crumble any day of the week. They're perfectly crisp. These are actually cooked, okay? They're not undercooked. That red velvet is so soft, but that icing, it's money. That red velvet's so good. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Too good, it's too way good. too good. So on this flight, we got Bourbon, pecan, banana pudding, strawberry cobbler, peach praline cobbler, and cherry cobbler, which I'm trying right now. Mmm. It's heavenly. Trying the cinnamon peach praline. Mmm. I just love cobblers. If you know what a cobbler is, comment down below what you think it is. To me, it's like a stuffed pie. I'm trying the strawberry cobbler. That's my first time trying cobbler, and that is amazing. When you tell me you got banana pudding on your list and there's 12 different ways that I can get it, I'm here for it. So I did the bourbon pecan um, banana pudding. Let's try it. 
Oh my God. I'm gonna need a moment with this right here. I am doing a cinnamon roll that's stuffed with blackberry cobbler. There's icing all over this. It looks like there's blackberry puree. Um, you, you, you need a knife for this, that's for sure. Let's see if I did it right here. Man, this thing is thick, y'all. Wow, that's a big bite. <laughs> That's bad news. That's really bad news. I might sit and eat this whole thing. That thing is no joke. It's rich. It's creamy. Those blackberries, those are fresh blackberries. That don't taste like something that's been sitting around. These are also made to order. This is money. Man. <laughs> that thing right there, that's dangerous. So many good flavors in that. Why does everything have to be exquisite? <laughs> Food review time. Remember, it's your first time here. We travel all across the United States showcasing off the best mom and pop shops and food that we can find for you guys. 28 states to date. Check out our interactive map. See everywhere we've been. We let you know where you can go waste money in a good way. Listen, most of you that watch the channel religiously, you know I'm not a big dessert dude. I was trying to find something here that I was just like, yeah, I can live without it. It's all delicious. Their cobblers are the truth. I grew up in the middle of nowhere in Ohio. I know what a good cobbler is, and it's crazy to me. So this is kind of like a mom, and, even though it's corporate, it's still kind of like a mom and pop shop because they're making everything in house every day. Um, the tea blew me away. I would have to say my favorite thing, no lie, was that stuffed cinnamon roll. That thing is to die for, y'all. Come in and get one of those. It's very rich, be aware. Um, they got a lot of cool things for options for everybody in here. The cookies, I think they're better in crumble. I just don't like crumble. Sorry, not sorry. Listen, I'm gonna go a 9.8. That's extremely high. It's 0.1 away from my perfect score, especially when it comes to dessert. You gotta come check this place out. Let's get right into the food. I haven't had any colors before. This is my first time trying cobbler and I loved it. It's like pie, but on a different level. We've been on a crazy series of flights lately. This is probably the best one. I will say that right now. The prices are great too. I'm going in 9.9. Who doesn't like sweets? I love sweets, uh, especially if there's savory in it too. Uh, and that's the little cobbler topping made it just right for me. I would have to say that cinnamon roll was my favorite of all so of the good. stuff. But if I had cherry in that cinnamon roll, it would make it even better. Cherry seems to be my favorite flavor for desserts. Um, I'm gonna have to go like a nine, eight. Desserts here are fantastic. Let people know why they should come see you and where they can find you. Guys, we're located at 4691 Morris Road in Gahan, Ohio, inside the Stone Ridge Shopping Center. We have 80 plus different combination of desserts, anywhere from cobblers, puddings, waffles, brownies, cookies, churros, we have milkshakes, you can do cold rush coffee, sweet peachy tea, you gotta come check us out. And you can check us out online, we're at peachcobblerfactory.com and you can also check out our websites on Instagram and Facebook.